Hey everybody. Alright. This is the uh, first page of All is Fair in Love and Parking Meters. Subtitle The Ideology of Art. Book One of the Gypsy Moon Trilogy. Forgive me, I have a missing tooth, so sometimes my words get a little bit slurred, but here we go. The prologue. The Harlequin Moon. New Mexico, 4th of July, 1994. Santiago McBoyle smoked an unfiltered camel as he circled the faded yellow 77 Dodge around the central plaza of Santa Fe. Affluent tourists crowded the expensive little square. As usual, Rastafarian rainbow children and a few old hippies were passing hand-carved stone pipes around the sandstone faded monument. Had to stop several times to let camera snapping vacations pass. He could see the reflections of his beat old truck cast from the picture windows of the high-priced tourist traps. It was poverty sliding over wealth and the contrast made him laugh. When he caught a glimpse of his face, he suddenly felt betrayed, knowing he wanted the beautiful life as much as anybody. He looked down San Francisco Street to see the setting sun in the purple hazed mountains 20 miles to the west. The nuclear city, Los Alamos, sparkled with tiny points of light. Sky rockets were blossoming like Magenta wounds in the dusk. Firecrackers poked shot holes in the city noise. The wail of police Orion echoed from the barriers. Santiago wanted to stop at Billy's Bar near the plaza, but a parking space was impossible to find. Just as he turned the corner in Water Street, he saw an empty meter. A woman driving a new Lexus had turned into a driveway and in reverse to come back to the vacant space. Santiago saw her and cut a quick U-turn and whipped into the open parking lot. As he got out of the truck, the Lexus pulled up next to him and stopped. A woman powered down the passenger window and gave Santiago a scalding look. Bastard! She hissed. Hey, all is fair and love and parking meters, he laughed with the sour look on the woman's face, but as she accelerated away, Alexis ran over his right boot. Son of a bitch! He yelled and looked down at his flattened toe, knowing he always paid for what he got. Page one.